New at five, a strongly worded document of an immigration audit, rather, of an immigration agency has just been released. The report outlining problems within the United States Citizenship and Immigration Services Department. Channel 5's Carolina Cruz is live to explain what the Inspector General's report revealed. The report looked at hiring practices for physicians in charge of those screenings. Several trouble areas were uncovered, including the hiring of physicians with history of patient abuse or a criminal record. The report stated the oversight is due to a lack of policies ensuring only suitable physicians are hired to perform those screenings. It also pointed to poor training of United States Citizenship and Immigration Services officers. They fail to spot deficiencies by the agency. One reason why they aren't providing formal training is because of workload. One, of two one or two officers are assigned to review about 50 physician applications a month. Also, prior to the report, USCIS did not ensure eligibility requirements or run background checks. So far, 132 physicians out of around 5,500 were found to pose a health or safety risk to patients seeking legal status in the country. One of those was a physician whose license was restricted for five years by the Texas Medical Board. The physician has a history of sexual misconduct and exploitation of female patients. USCIS is making changes. The agency is reevaluating all active physicians to meet the newly developed requirements. This will be done to identify non-compliant physicians. Most of the changes to those procedures are expected to be completed by September 30th of next year. Reporting live in the newsroom, Carolina Cruz, Channel 5 News at 5.